Yo guys, what's going on? Welcome back to Season 3, Episode 5 of the Bordeaux Career Mode here. Got a big episode planned, we got some big games coming up. Uh, Lille and Lyon, and Stavrenay, I believe. Uh, I want to give a quick apology um, to uh, to all you guys. I've had a pretty inconsistent schedule recently, got a lot of stuff going on. I gotta stay focused with school and stuff, family stuff, but um, that's going on. Also, a massive thank you, we got 200 subs. I think this is our first, might be our second, second video since 200 subs. Wanted to give a big thank you. It's been great, but um, in the video, we're going to uh, make some changes here. Hector Herrera, you know, last season, most assists. It was a great signing, picked him up on a free from Atletico Madrid. But this year, he hasn't been the same. So, uh, De Hood will probably slide into that starting role a little more comfortably. We're going to sim the first half of this one. Timothy Castagna and Matt Miyazaga are in there for Lille, and uh, this is not an ideal start, 28 minutes in, Josh Major picks up a red card, but other than that, nothing happened, so we'll jump into the 60th here, down to 10 men, but I think we can hold our own, on paper it's a very weak Lille squad, on paper we're a very strong Bordeaux squad, high overall players, just gotta depend if I can actually play the game properly, which it's been a doubt the past couple episodes, so uh, Adley goes down, that's got to be a red card, he's taking him out from behind on the corner attack, no foul, sorry, no, no cards to the referee. Now here's Ratchich, back to Asby, it's a lovely ball, beautiful vision out to Hans Hatzebor, into the middle, here's Ellis Free, header, just wide, sent it down on the goalkeeper's left, just wide of the post. Good effort though, keep making these chances, the goals will come eventually. As Karnazias, I don't even know, sends one up to Torreira, Asby wins well. Now here is Santi Campos, driving the defense here, looking for the run of Kakashi. It's a good run here, Kakashi is in, slips one into the middle, Adley tried to get there. Asby can recollect though, now Campos, turns one way, past another, past Miyazaga, Campos goes down in the box, 71 minutes in, we have a penalty kick. 10 men Bordeaux with a massive chance to take the lead here at home. Albert Ellis will step up here. If, if it lets me shoot, hopefully he'll step up in a second here. Um, Albert Ellis will step up. There we go. Okay, now I have no marker. Um, I'm not really sure what to do here. I guess we can take it to a sim and hope for the best. That's the only thing I can think. We'll sim then jump in quickly. We can get the shot off still, maybe? No, he's already taken it. Okay, if I miss this, if I miss this, it's going to be really... This, this is why, this is why, this is why you can't play this game, right? Because it's just a big waste of time, right? There's like, there's no point in playing this game, because you can't score. And then when you do get, when you do get a good opportunity to score, the game's just like, nah, we'll just send in a nice glitch here. Off the line by Pembele. Torreira gets to it first, marked by Aspi. I honestly don't care anymore. I was given pretty good commentary as well, but that's just completely ruined the vibe. Into the middle, that one will go right out of bounds, and it's a corner, that's the wrong decision from the ref. Um, whatever, that's not a corner, that's not a corner, this is ridiculous. Absolutely ridiculous. Into the middle here, cleared away by Ellis, I think it was. Adley tracking him down, here's Torreira, a lot of space in the middle. Gomez, out wide to Andre. Back out, now trying to clear that one. Can't get it gone, and he goes, wait, what? A penalty? What happened? I didn't do anything. I, was I hit B to clear the ball, and he's given a penalty. What's going on? No, give me, give me the instant replay. Well, we're gonna call this VAR here. We're gonna check for the possible penalty review. Okay. Well, he's not involved in the play, but that's a pretty blatant push in the back. I was still pretty terrible refing, in my opinion. Go to the left. Oh, we trail one nil. 80th minute, time for a uh, tactical masterclass here. Let me switch this to ultra attacking. Then we'll get it. The three four two one's my go-to formation when we're uh, when we're down. So that is what I will. Uh, that's what I'll go with here. If I can find it, where is it? here we go. Three four two one. We're gonna put Maja at center back. Um, you know I, I hate to blame. I hate to put the blame on someone. 
But the blame either goes to the EA developers or Josh Manager for this one. So we'll put him in a nice, nice wide right wing back role. And we'll have a, uh, a left center back, a right center back. Two center backs. Um, I, I trust him. I trust Lukumi. I trust Tadibo. Left center back. Where is it? There we go. And then we'll put Billy Gilmore, like a defensive midfield role here. Uh, a little more central. There we go. So we'll have him as kind of like a deep line playmaker. And then we'll slide Ratchet up to attacking the midfield. There we go. Make that a cam. Alright, this is the best shot we've got. That is a that is a nice formation. Let me switch it to balanced. Now does it work? There we go. So we got a two a two one a two one two one two one formation here. And it's already not working. Here comes Leal on the counterattack. Off the bar. Can he get there? Game over. Oh, he's offsides. He's offsides. All right. Game is still on. Tadebo blocks it. Now this one down. Tadebo blocks again. Now we'll send this one out wide to Kakasha. He's got a chance to counterattack here. Looking into the middle here. We've got it to Campos. Stop. We lost the ball. Game over. An infuriating defeat. To Leal. Are they going to score again? No, they're not. They're not going to score again. He's missed. You suck. An infuriating defeat to Leal at home. We head to the Europa Conference League, the most pointless competition in the history of competitions. Quick sim with the B team against Istanbul. Bashishki here. Do they have any of the guys? No. I know Kuduchu. I think he played for Schalke. And, uh,. I know they used to have that one guy that scored against Manchester United. He was from, like, Bosnia or something. I don't know what happened to him. Um, quick sim. This one should be a win. Oh, we concede a late goal. And we lose. So, on the game against Leon here. Away from home, Jesus up top. Zerdan Shakiri. He's actually the highest paid player in the MLS, I just learned. Toka, Kambi, and Mendez on the wings. Paqueta and Zielinski. That's a good uh, midfield there. Uh, Kone, Bastoni, Boateng, Lorenzi, and Lopez make up the defense. That's a pretty weak team, to be honest with you. I think we can win. That defense is looking weak, but we know Gabriel Jesus. We know what he does. I think he scored a hat-trick against us last season. He is, he's ruthless. Um, I don't see, he's been on my radar for a little bit. I, I would like to get him. Um... Because he's, 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 he's been pretty damn good. So, uh, here comes Shakiri Out uh, the center. Still driving. Tadebo wins it. And can I just clear that? Nope. Okay, what happened to the advantage there, ref? What happened to the advantage? And now here's Jesus. He's in. This is ridiculous, okay? The ref played the advantage for, like, one second. Usually it's, like, at least five seconds. So I just cleared away. We trail 1-0. Two minutes in. Now here they come again. Jesus stings the crossbar from 30 yards out. Good chance by the Brazilian. Now you Toko Akambi and again Leon dominating the chances here. In this first half into Gabriel Jesus. Oh my goodness. Alright, we're signing him in the winter. That is an absolute beautiful shot. You'll see that on the thumbnail. That's on the thumbnail for sure. An absolute beauty. The half volley with his back to goal. That's an incredible strike from the former Manchester City man. Look at that. That is amazing. That is an amazing goal from Gabriel Jesus. But we gotta look to keep this game going. Rachic, lovely vision to find Pembele. We're in here. Slide across. Ellis blocks by Boateng. He takes Boateng out as well in revenge. Good stuff, Ellis. But uh, Leon able to escape thus far. If we win this header, Adley wins it. Now here's Ellis. Through the middle. Big save by Lopez. Good save by the Portuguese shot stopper. Now here comes Ellis again, driving forward. Nice body feint. It's a good ball in the middle. We were looking for Adley there. Dropped towards Pambele. Volley is blocked. Now can Hector Herrera keep this one in? He can. Good stuff from the Mexican. Now Todibo. This is a lovely bit of play. And Herrera's got space. We can look to cross this one into the middle. You see Adley. Big save by Lopez again. And Hector Herrera goes down under pressure. Could have been a penalty. Ref says no. We jump for the second half. 
Here comes Santi Campos in the 55th minute. Lovely ball over the top. Ellis escapes from Paqueta. Albert Ellis here scores. We have cut the deficit in half. Get the ball. Get the ball. Get the ball. All right. Okay, whatever. Cut the deficit in half. 2-1 Albert Ellis. 56th minute. Things you love to see. Corner chance here in the 66. We'll take it short to Pembele. Inside the Campos. Looking for an angle for a shot here. Can't find one. Lakumi will look for Adli. That's someone that can cross the ball nice. Try to get around him. Oh, that's a good move. Into the middle. Ellis, big save again by Lopez. He has been on incredible form today for Leon. He's saved them a couple of chances at least. And now we've got a 4-on-3 for Leon. And here's Shakiri. Shakiri trying to get past one. He does. Big block by the injured Hans Hatsabor off the bench. And now he can clear that one away. It's a poor clearance though. Now here is Gabriel Jesus. One well. By Sadibo. Now here's Hatsabor. Looking to find a ball. That's a lovely ball. That's Santi Campos now. Try to cut this one across. Albert Ellis. Composure out the window. Our usually clinical Honduran has... Missed the target. That's what I'll go with. But wasting no time as we jump into this game against Sabrina. Decent team. Actually, I saw Benjamin Beauregard had a nice meg a couple days ago. But uh, Sabrina opened the scoring. 35th minute. 36th minute. Laborde. Good goal. But uh, we will try to respond quickly here. Nice bit of play, top of the area here. Whoa, just wide by uh, number 29, by Albert Ellis, just wide by the Honduran. Gosh, tries to step up to win this one. Now here comes Santa Maria on the break. Into Beauregard. Now here is Niang. Oh my, 22, who's that? Big save by Le Comte. Cleared away by Kakashi. Can he get there first? Doesn't matter, half time. I'm gonna be honest. This is this is post commentary recording, and uh, I thought that I uh, that I like cut this part out. I don't know why it's still in there. Um, so if you're somehow still watching to hear, you've seen a uh, a dreadful blunder by myself. Um, no, nothing's gonna happen. I don't think. Like another three minutes, two minutes here. Um, so that's my bad. <laughs> um, here comes Safrane. Love board with the ball. Giresi Johnson now sends that one out of bounds for a goal kick. Yeah, this should not be in the video. But honestly, time is tight, so uh, just gonna improv this one. Nekomte sends that one out wide to Kakashi. We lose the ball. It's poor from me. Santa Maria now intercepted well by Asby, and then intercepted well again by Borgard. Lia Silki now Borgard. Yeah, it shouldn't even be record commentary here. Uh, here is Janssen. He's in. L Silky. Oh, that's a good ball to the board. Can he score a big save? Okay, that part should be in. There we go. Here we go. Now everything's working as planned. Aspi wins it well. Now we can look to Hans Hatzibor on the break. We've got four people. Four players. Numbers in the middle. Just going to keep pushing this one up. Or a good ball in the middle. Ellis. Again, just too far left of the goalkeeper. Really not been his day so far. Hatsabor can win that one. Back to Lecomte with neat options here. Nice risky pass though. Now here's Azpi up to Ratchich. Maja, one more to Azpi. This is good play so far. We need someone in support. No one in support. We're just going to curve that one. Try to get it around Perrin, the former Juventus goalkeeper. It's a good save, and now here comes Jeremy Doku. He was a nightmare to play against, but Kakashi holds his ground well. Now here's Ratchich into Aspi. One more to Mo Dahoud. Up to Ellis. Now here's Albert Ellis driving the counterattack forward. It's a good ball. Zahoud on the angle. Can he make it? Big save by the Italian again. The chances are coming, though. Here comes. Intercepted again. Adley. We need numbers here. Ellis escapes past one. Another. Albert Ellis on the left foot. Okay, this is ridiculous. Albert Ellis. Albert Ellis is, uh. He's gonna spend some time on the bench. Because, uh. 
terrible form. Here comes the hood. Taken by Sulemano now. End of the game. It doesn't really matter. Are they going to score? Lakumi leaves the ball behind. Stop Rene. The last, second to last kick of the game. They've scored. It's Laborde again with his second. Well, that is a lovely episode for you. Four games played. Four losses. It's like eight goals conceded. Lovely stuff. Um, so yeah, we need, as you can see, it's not going to plan. It's not going to plan at all. We started the episode third. Now we're sixth, but um, only three points off a of third. So hope is not lost yet. Uh, we're gonna want a striker. We got Santi Campos. He has good potential. Very young. So I think we'll probably look to sell Albert Ellis and go for uh, Gabriel Jesus. I guess that would be the most ideal situation. Uh, Campos has good potential, as I was saying. Sorry, something bugged out with the recording. But, uh, we'll probably play Star Bristois, Bohemian, and Troy's off camera. And then we'll play Marseille and hopefully be able to jump into the window as well next episode. Um, we'll probably sim Claremont. I don't know. We'll do something in the episode, in the window. So suggest some signings, please. We need a backup defensive midfielder. We need a new striker. And honestly, anything. Ratchet. If we want to sell him, we could, but I'll probably sell Ellis, maybe Maja, um, but yeah, anything you want, join the Discord down below so you can help out, like the video, subscribe if you're new, thank you for doing for subscribers, um, yeah, there's the squad, but, uh, I'll see you next time, uh, thank you for watching.